All right, how's it going, everybody? Destiny's been pretty boring lately, as told by, um... So I thought, what's a way to make it less boring? And then I thought, why not make the best build that I possibly can? You know, I'm, I'm so tired of making stupid builds that are bad or, or, or... Oh, it's, it's funny because it's bad. You know, it's not funny anymore when I do that. So I thought I would finally make a build that is actually worth your time to use and is actually good. So today we have what is called the Architect. That's at least what I like to call it. So let me show you the build. Here it is. So we're on Stasis Titan today. One of the best subclasses, uh, if I do say so myself, as shown by the fact that it is the most used subclass in the game. Like, it's been consistently good ever since it came out. Which, you know, I can't say the same about for a lot of the other subclasses in the game. So we have Behemoth, and we're also rocking Howl of the Storm and Glacier Grenades. And that's just so we can create two walls. And then with that, we also have on Horfrost Z, so I can make a third wall with a window. Because every house needs a window, you know? And then we have Salvation's Grip. This is just so I can, like, maybe make a fourth wall. Sometimes it's a little bit shaky. The fourth wall kind of looks like if a 85-year-old man fell asleep at the wheel of his 2008 Chevy Silverado and crashed directly into your wall. That's kind of, like, what it looks like. It's a little bit all over the place, but, you know, it- I mean, it still works as long as you keep the Silverado there. Then for the rest of the weapons, we have on Warden's Law, one of the best hand cannons because, I mean, the thing about it is that it fires three bullets, all the other ones fire only one. It's kind of a no-brainer. Uh, next we have Python. Now, Python has Overflow and also Shield Disorient, and a lot of enemies in Destiny have shields. And then with Overflow, having more ammo inevitably is always a plus, and I can't think of any other gun with a perk in that column that is better than Overflow. So, that's my reasoning for that. As for my mods, this is what I have on, you know, just like hands-on resilience where I got some stasis resistance because... All right, we're playing Presage. I feel like this is the best place to test it out, mainly because, well, the bouncer wouldn't let me into Grandmasters and my game, I guess, just said fuck you and isn't allowing me to enter Lost Sectors, like Legend Lost Sectors. It's Skydock 4 today, and I, for some reason, it just, it's not showing up. Like, I've done it, I've done it, you know, just in case the game was bugged and, and thought I hadn't done it, even though, you know, it's fucking Skydock 4, I have, I did it twice, and it just still didn't show up, and it shows up on my Warlock. But we're not playing Midlock today, we're playing Titan, with possibly the best build in all of Destiny. You know, I, yeah, I know that I made the whole Destiny is boring and, like, the whole build crafting thing, but I take all my negative words about build crafting back because this is the pinnacle of all build crafting, right here. It's a very unique build, being able to get my grenade and my class ability back fast. I've never seen any other build like it with this build crafting system. God, I, I truly do love Presage. I don't think I've actually ever played it on this channel. Wow. Presage feels like such a huge part of Destiny. At least for me. Or at least my enjoyment about it. About Destiny. Or at least used to, because then they removed it. But now they added it back. But you know what they haven't added back? Any of the other good missions. Uh, well, I mean, they added Seraph Shield back, which was good. But then they were like, okay, Harbinger? No. Well, to be fair, Harbinger is a weaker mission. But Whisper? No. Zero Hour? Hmm. No. Vox Obscura. Oh, everybody loves Vox Obscura. Give me a break. Watch this. I mean, like, truly the capabilities of the Sand Cannon, you know, they're underestimated. I mean, like, I was able to kill one of the Screebs. I mean, I'm 99% sure you're not even supposed to kill them. You know, a bunch of gave them so much health. I'm pretty sure it's it's a intended feature that you get blown up by them. You just activate that. I'm activating the Ancient Inter... Oh, wait, no. I forgot that this is a, uh... This is a 2024 Foamy video, not 2023 Foamy. I forgot. I forgot. Now you're probably asking, well, what's the difference? 2023 Foamy, 2024 Foamy? It's just a year difference. Well, you see, 2023 Foamy still was, like, enthusiastic about Destiny. And now here I am, coming up with fucking, like, playing Presage while building houses. That's the video. That, that's the video. I could have been finished my game by now. I could have been the next Scott Cawthon. I feel like that might be a bad example. I could have been the next Toby Fox. You are such a fucking bitch, you know that? Like, I'm trying to do something. I'm trying to hit these fuses, and you're there exploding. I don't appreciate it. Are we not taught manners nowadays? When I was a kid, I was taught manners. 
but it has become abundantly clear to me that that is something that is no longer taught as evident by the absolute lack of any form of, of, of manners from these screebs. I don't know why I did that. It was intrusive thoughts. I'm not gonna lie to you. I did it because I wanted to. First try, baby! Apparently fucking not- I shot all of them. Oh, I have to shoot them again. First try! Yeah! I knew where they all were, too. Because I'm, like, you know, I'm good at the scam. Uh, unlike some people, Celtic Grappa, I'm sorry to say it, but, you know, you're just not that guy anymore. Me, however, well, you know, I don't even think I have to say that I'm that guy, because I think everybody knows. It's kind of like common knowledge at this point, you know, that I'm just that guy. I think it's safe to say that the representation of, like, Destiny YouTube has kind of moved over. It used to be Dado, kind of shifted over to Astacross for a while. And then now the torch has been passed. Not even passed. I, I went and took it. You know, not I, I, I went and grabbed it. I went and firmly grasped the torch and claimed what is rightfully mine as the king of Five Nights at uh, Destiny 2 YouTube. I mean, sure, like, what other weapon would do that other than the shotgun? This sounds so familiar. I'm running out of video ideas. I'm so sorry. Feels like I'm playing Lethal Company. Better look behind me and see a fucking coil head. Oh, fuck my ass. That's a coil head up there. I would say I need to avoid stepping on a landmine, but I kind of feel like that ship has sailed considering I'm playing Destiny 2. I'm such a Debbie Downer today, god. I have the same amount of enthusiasm right now as a kid who's being told by his parents that they're all moving to West Virginia. Like, I'm- I'm beyond the point of like a fake yippee or any of that. I'm- I'm- no, I'm- I'm- there- there's no- I haven't made a single house yet. I- you know, I feel like I should... Uh, make a house. You know what I mean? I don't have a grenade, so it's kind of like Grandpa crashed through all walls here. And I blew up the house. Okay, well, it is floating. I can't push it around. I think that this game should be fully recreated on the Source engine. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Okay, hold on. Well, hey, can you- I need to- I need to make a safety house. I need to make a safety house. Fuck, that's not what I want. All right, we have a safety house. All right, all right, all right, back to safety. That was a wise investment. You know, if this was Vancouver, that would be at least $2,500 a month. Not even downtown Vancouver, like Metro Vancouver, like Coquitlam or something. Who actually lives in Coquitlam? If you actually live in Coquitlam, like, please let me know. I'm expecting to not see a single comment from anybody that lives in Coquitlam. Because I, I simply refuse to believe anybody actually lives there. Well, I don't refuse to believe it, you know, I, I will believe it when I see it. Because nobody fucking lives there. Empty. It's like that one North Korean village on the border with South Korea. What is it, the North Korean, like, village of happiness or some shit? I don't even know what it's fucking called, you know what I'm talking about. All right, let's come on. I need to build my safety house uh, to get safety. And that does not include you being here. And I tore down the whole fucking building. I rammed my Chevy Silverado right fucking through it. I stole Grandpa's Chevy Silverado and I rammed that shit straight into an orphan. I've realized I don't actually want to spend a million years playing fucking Destiny 2. I'm gonna die. I actually might need to build a safety house. You're not coming in here. Hold on. Look at this house! Oh, and we gotta build the granddad wall. I really like how when they rework Salvation's Grip, they forgot to make it consistent when charging it up. I really like that. Because, I mean, sometimes you can hold it for two seconds. I might be fucking stupid. I just realized how it works. I'm... Bungie, I hope you don't take anything I'm saying as an insult. I enjoy being on your press list. I get all the press emails, you know, and I would like to stay on that because I very much appreciate it. I may not receive the creator silver or, or the invites to the summits, and that's totally fine because I understand that I'm just too... I'm like an overwhelming presence, you know what I mean? It's like you ever walk into a mall in like a big city and you go in there and you just immediately n your nostrils are being fucking vaporized. All, like everything from like the tip of your nose all the way back to your sinuses are being absolutely evaporated, uh, just completely decimated by the smell of Cinnabon. That's kind of what it's like, but the scent is less of Cinnabon and more of Pink Frosted Sprinkle Donut from Smosh Food Battle 2010. Start building some houses. 
God, with how many houses I'm building, you would not think I'm Canadian. Oh, but- Oh, hey, hey, I put a lot of work into that, you fucking piece of shit. You fucking dick. You fucking piece of shit. You know how much work I put into that? I pressed two buttons, you piece of shit. House building. It's like that one game Jerma likes to play. Alright, just so nobody shoots us, I'll leave you alive. I'll spare you as long as you. There we go, just have to build a little bit of a house here. Uh, it's like a home office, actually. Yo, here's the- here's the bedroom. Sleep here, it's nice next to the heater. Here's the office. Here is, like, the bathroom. Here's the kitchen. Here's a window looking at the wall. It's kind of like living in New York City. The Valorant player mind cannot comprehend this. What, a good game? Well, I wouldn't call this good. I'm having conversations with imaginary people now. This has gone way too out of hand. This is why I don't make videos by myself anymore, because, you know, usually when I make videos with other people, there's people to stop me, uh, and tell me, you know, that that's not a good thing to say. People will think you're going fucking mentally insane. That doesn't exist here. Maybe I should, like, actually say, I'm fine. This is all for a bit. I just want to make sure people don't think I'm, like, actually going fucking mentally insane. Anywho, that guy got fucking annihilated. I'm not gonna even lie, some people probably get off from this shit over here. I'm calling you out, the one motherfucker who is watching this video. But that'll be all for today, so thank you so much for watching, and as always, go fuck yourself.